part of something strong. And from the day that we are born, there's a voice we can. What's going on? What's happening? I don't know, but I don't like the look of it. We could be in deep trouble. How many you two? Faster, faster! They've all got to come down. We can't take all day on each one. Oh, but it's hard work, boss. Can't you give us a hand? A hand? A hand? I'm supervising. I'm planning. I'm overseeing. I'm controlling. I haven't got time to give hands. Get a move on. Guy. Put him in the compound and any others you find. We'll dump him somewhere later. Now, get sawing. This depot has to be finished and operating soon, or Mr. Rapplione will have your miserable hides. Just ours? What about yours? Me? No, never. Not mine. I'm too much of an asset to Ratko for my position to be in jeopardy. Executive material, don't you see? Well, he's demoted you a whole bunch of times before. Demoted? Never. Rubbish. Sent me into lower ranks to absorb working conditions from a grassroots viewpoint, yes? Demoted. Me? Never. One, why are we building a train depot here anyway, huh? For the storage and distribution of freight, dummy. But you and I have been looking. There's no rails anywhere. Rails? Rails? We don't need rails. But trains run on rails, one. Do you think I don't know that? The rails come later. Shouldn't they be first one to bring us our supplies? Shut, Shut up! Her. You two just got on and do as you're told. Leave the technicalities to us planners with brains and experience. Oh. Mm, come on. Sorry, but I gotta lock you up. Travels take us to all corners of the world, but the Australian Outback? Hey, don't worry. We're just entering the Yalta Aboriginal Reserve. We'll find food and water here. Just relax. I can hear a train coming. A what? A train. Listen. He's right. There is something. But it's not a train. Nope. The noise is coming from behind that big rock over there. Let's take a look. Hi there. Do you know where we can get a drink? Over there by that old tree, there's a billabong. What's a billabong? Can you eat it? Are you hungry? Yeah, I'm always hungry. You can have the rest of my lunch if you like. Mm, maggots. You don't like them? Suit yourself. They're fresh today. I think it's the first time I've lost my appetite. I'll stay hungry. Guess we better introduce ourselves. This is Dalin, Slow Lee, and I'm Bamboo Lee. What's your name? I'm Ernest. Pleased to meet you, Ernest. What's that you're playing? It's called a didgeridoo. Play us a tune. It 
makes me want to dance. I like that. <laughs> then go ahead. Okay, I will. <laughs> Wait a second. What are you three doing so far from home? Well, we're kind of wildlife troubleshooters. Oh, yeah? What luck. Maybe you could shoot some trouble over there at Rock Springs. Why? Huh? What's at Rock Springs? You see those signals on Bleak Point over there? Yeah, I see. But what about them? They tell me that a colony of koalas have big problems. They're in grave danger. They need moving into a new site. There's one not far from them. But it won't be easy. Go on, Bamboo Lee. Throw the cane. We'll get Ai Ai back and get over there and try to help. <laughs> <laughs> You're not as good as Slow Lee. Just come back. Wow, what? A... <laughs> mm -hmm. You see, I'm better than you thought. Don't be afraid, Ernest. Whoa. She's friendly. Silliest kangaroo I ever saw. And pink, too. Do you mind, sir? Kangaroo, indeed. I'll have you know, my family are... Okay, I, I, I. He's never seen a dragon before. Well, all right. No House says you have to go to... Rock, Rock Springs. Springs! Oh, how did you know? Ernest here. He told us the koalas over there had some kind of a problem. Okay, then I'll tap in my guidance system and off we go. Thanks for the drink, Ernest, and the music. We'll do our best for the koalas. Goodbye and good luck, you three, and that uh, thingy what's it do jar thingy. Uh... Thingy what's it do jar indeed. I'll take his didgeridoo and aye I'll. Aye. Well, who does he think he is? Yes, I, I, we know. Now, calm down and let's go. It's awful. Let's call No How. <laughs> Hi there, No How. Bamboo Lee here. Hello, Bamboo Lee. Hope you are well and keeping busy. Yeah. It looks like we really are going to be busy. These koalas are in trouble. Uh, well, according to my information, Ratco are constructing a storage depot and leisure facilities for the passengers and crew of the tea and sugar trains that cross South and West Australia. Unfortunately, their plans include cutting down the eucalyptus forest and destroying the habitat of a colony of koala bears. Pretty drastic measures. The koalas will be wiped out. Then we'll just have to stop them. Not much chance of that, I'm afraid. It's most certainly too late already. So what are we going to do? Try to relocate the koalas. They need to eat between 500 grams and one kilogram of eucalyptus leaves per day. You have to help them. They only move slowly and can't travel far. Yeah. Thanks, Know How. We'll keep an eye out for it. Come on, we'll have to investigate. There's no one around, but there's a trailer on that side over there. Let's start asking some questions. Who are you? And what do you want? Excuse me, sir. Where are the koala bears? And what business is it of yours? Well, their habitat is being destroyed, and we thought maybe we could help. Oh, you did, did you? With no trees, they will die of starvation. They need to go to a site environmentally suited to them. Well, for your information, that's just what we're about to do. Take them where they are environmentally... Where they're better off. So beat it. So where are you taking them, then? We're gonna dump, uh, uh, escort them to the, uh, the desert. The desert? They'll have nothing to eat! Of course they will. Like what? Like, uh, well, uh, sand. Yes, sand. You can't eat sand. You can eat sand pies and sandwiches. Yummy. Come on, where are they supposed to go? I got other fish to fry. They don't eat fish. For your information, they only eat eucalyptus leaves, and you're cutting all their trees down. Them ain't their trees. They're ratcos. I've got my job to do. Ratco again. 
That means we're gonna have to take matters into our own hands. You do what you like. But this is private property, so don't put a foot on it again. Get off and stay off! Ooh. Why don't you let them take the koalas, one? They'll be off our hands. Cause I've got other plans for them, stupid. Make us a little bonus on the side. That's a good idea, one. Of course it is. That's what leadership's about. I'm full of good ideas. So what's the good idea? Uh, yes, uh, that. Well, there's a tourist park in Central Sydney, and they'll buy this little lot from us. What for? Well, they stick them in cages, and the ones that don't bite, they let out for tourists to hold and photograph. So, why didn't you tell the others that you were going to relocate them? Because it's illegal to sell them, dummy. Oh. I can't give our little game away. As soon as this project is on the move, I'll ship oh. them out and pick up the money. <laughs> Whee! Rich! Rich! We're gonna be rich! Well, uh, not a rich. Uh, there's a lot of expenses involved. And tax to pay, customs duty, and transportation, and veterinary fees. Lots of things you don't understand, but there should be enough for you both to have a few dollars. <laughs> a few dollars? And your share? My share is my business. Besides, it's always the brains that takes the lion's share. What lion? We don't have a lion, I hope. Of course there's no lion, stupid. I mean, it's the natural salary scale structure priority. <laughs> yeah, it's called priority number one. <laughs> no house said there's a river nearby. Aye, I can find that for us. There's a compound behind the trailer. That must be where the koalas are locked up. With nothing to eat, I know how they feel. There's plenty of logs, ropes, oil drums, and stuff lying around. We can build a raft, release the koalas, load them on board, and float them downstream. Look, I'm gonna scout around and have a word with the koalas. They've gotta be warned and ready to move. Okay, meanwhile, we'll gather as much stuff as possible and build the raft on the riverbank. Great, and I, I, would you just do an aerial trip downstream and find us a landing site? Not too far, mind you. No problem, Bamboo Lee. As soon as Dunny said, is ready or it will be or something. Yeah, let's go. Shh. I'm here to help you. Trust me. I'm not a rat. Look, have you got a leader? Come to the fence. I, I want to talk. Somebody has to make a move. Guess I'll give it a go. My friends are building a raft. When it's ready, we'll come and get you and float you all downstream to the next eucalyptus forest where you're gonna be safe. <laughs> We're not too keen on water, Cobra. We don't even drink it. Look, you don't have to drink it, swim in it, paddle in it, or even get your feet wet. Just sit on it and float. It's your only chance. Okay, Cobra. Butte. We'll give it a chance, eh, lads? That's fantastic. You've done a great job in the raft. Let me give you a hand with the finishing touches. Yep, that should do it. Slowly carried all those logs by himself. Makes you hungry, you know. I'm sure it does, Slowly. We'll see to that as soon as possible. I've had it to fly about, and there's a lovely spot not too far downstream. I didn't need to go further, and there's ample eucalyptus trees. Great. Just finish off the raft, and we're ready to sail. Well. I'll be off then. Okay, I, I. Goodbye, oh, and thanks for your that's help. That's all in Bye. a dragon's day's work. Bye-bye, all. Bye. Okay, guys. Time to go and get Dundee and his friends. But be real quiet. If we wake the rats, we're gonna be in big trouble. Dundee! Dundee! Are you awake? Too right, mate. We're all awake and ready to go. Good. Look, we've made a way through the fence. Crawl through one by one. Follow me. Put your horse away, one. The koalas, the koalas, the koalas, the koalas, they're gone. What about them? They playing baseball or something? No, they're gone.
thing. They're gone. Here, take these. I don't know how those things got through the fencing, but start rounding them up again and make it quick. When we catch them all, Gee, look, we'll... Look what I found. Wow, that's pretty. What is it? I don't know, but it could be a vital clue. Clue? Clue? Don't be so stupid. We haven't got time Ooh. for your silly remarks. Here, give me that thing and get on searching. Now, let's get rid of this. Now, where was I before I was interrupted? Ah, uh, yes, it's all coming back to me. Hey! Who did that? Uh, you did, boss. Me? Me? How could I hit myself in the back of the head? It's one of these. Put that down, will you, and find those koalas. Right, find koalas. There's one, boss. There, in the long grass. I saw it move. Then jump on it, numbskull. Get it into the sack. Okay. from a kangaroo. <laughs> he, he does now, boss. <laughs> You're laughing, huh? You couldn't catch a cold in Iceland, stupid. Now pick him up and let's get on with it. Those rats will be after us once they find you're missing. Mm. He's right. We know you're not used to moving quickly, but this is an emergency. I think it's about the right pace, personally. Going faster makes you hungry. Yeah, but going faster also makes you get to the food quicker. Wow, I hadn't thought of that. Let's run. Never mind. We're nearly there now. <laughs> the raft is tied up against the bank. <laughs> Here it is. I'll help you on. You won't even get your feet wet. Whoa. I'll kill him. I'll murder him for this. Get my hands on him. Always interfering. The koalas are my personal private mentors. From my private... I want him back. There they are. Look, just ahead. Well, well, well. What have we got here? What a beautiful package. All dressed up and nowhere to go. Yeah, like the boss said. We got you stuck. Let him just sweat a while. Then we'll pull him in easy, like a fish on a line. <laughs> then what'll we do, boss? Chop him up in pieces, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, in pieces, like that. And that, and that, and that, and it. Oh. You loony! Look what you've done! There, they're getting away! Look, uh, boss, I, I didn't mean uh, it to do it. Come back! Just as well those rats are stupid, or we would have been in big trouble. What's that? I thought I heard a rumble. Probably Slowly's stomach. He's still hungry. No, it's not. It's thunder. Yeah, you're right. But it's not the thunder you mean. Oh, you don't think? Yes, I do. It's the thunder of the rapids. Oh, no. It's moving too fast for me to steer into the bank. And look, that's the mooring sign I, I found. We're going to slide right past it. What'll we do? Give me that oar, and you take the rope and try to lasso something on the bank. OK, there's an old landing jetty coming up. I'll have a shot at that. Wish me luck. Close. Well done, Slowly. You saved us all. <laughs> we were passing a load of apple trees, and I need my supper. Well, for once.
once your stomach came in handy, <laughs> and we're here where we want it to be. Yeah, and just look at those eucalyptus trees. Okay, boys? Yeah, Blue, this is great. And clean and peaceful. We have to go and eat and sleep now, but we'll never forget what you cobbles did for us. Thanks, Bamboo Lee. Thanks, darling. Thanks, Slow Lee. Well, well, that's it. <laughs> we soon got rid of that lot. <laughs> no, we didn't. They left and took the koalas and a bonus with them. Okay, okay, so what? They're all gone, and I've got our little project tied up fine. All ready to go. Ratlioni will be over the moon. Probably promote me to head off and straight off. <laughs> but, one, there ain't no rails. Shut up. Oh. We told you, one, not a rail in sight. Will you two keep quiet? I'm under the chief. Ratlioni. Ah, uh, Mr. Ratlioni, it's Rat One Storage Complex. With very good news, sir. The complex and parking is practically finished and looks beautiful. No tea and sugar train will pass us by. Rock Springs is ready. <laughs> what did you just say, One? Uh, I said Rock Springs is ready. Have you seen a sugar train pass since you started construction, One? Why, uh, no. Uh, too busy, you understand. No time for idle gawping. So much organizing. Jobs to be done. Supervising at the highest level. Keeping my eye on... Shut the up! Uh... Now, do you want the bad news first? Or the very bad? The bad news That's first? That's right. But very bad. Now, you know why you haven't seen a sugar train pass one? Uh, no time to look, sir. No. Because they passed at Spring Rocks. 300 kilometers south of Rock Springs. You mean you... You mean we uh, got the rail wrong of the rock... That's right, Ryan. And, uh, yeah. and the very bad news is that my boys will be visiting for an explanation as to how this happened. Sleep well.